Okay, so I contributed as a songwriter in this album. I am Cheryl Shinafia, and I am the songwriter for Rini's latest album called Skins. I wrote Come Home and Underrated with Karini, and um, yeah, that's my contribution for Skins. Single Rini, yang mana sih yang menurut kalian paling special dan kenapa? I feel like mm -mm, born ready. <tune> It's the most special song in this album because, I mean, the lyric says it all. I remember exactly writing that song. We were, it was just the two of us talking at her porch and she went deep into talking about how she misses her dad, uh, her late dad, and how her dad and Rini had a very special bond and then I feel like that's how it all started this journey of the album the process of making it I think it started off when Rini went really vulnerable in talking about uh, her life she's just not trying to prove anything to anyone you know I feel like there's a huge difference between the old Rini Wolanderi in her previous albums. The difference is, I feel, the album independent. I feel like she was trying to prove everyone that like, you know, I'm really independent and you know, like I can show to the world that I can do it myself. This album Skins, she doesn't feel the need to like prove anything to anybody. She just, you know, she loves making songs and she is a creative, talented, very talented person. And then she just wants to just, you know, put it out there and also, she she has changed like she shows you she's an evolved artist she is who she is you know being very true to herself and that's most important and i feel like this is why skins is very essential to her growth as an artist i mean that's that is the greatest thing ever coming from an artist i feel when she doesn't feel the need to prove to anyone but herself song in your album is still come home not because i wrote it but solely because you wrote it for nord and i have a very soft spot when it comes to your son you know that i'm sorry i'm busy it never feels easy i'm out to provide the love you deserve dan ini lagu lucu banget kita sebenarnya udah bikin satu lagu lainnya, udah hampir satu, tapi tiba-tiba jam 11 maleman gitu Javin telepon, terus dia belum mau pulang dan Rini bilang kayak come home, come home, come home. So we wrote it actually as initially as a romantic song, and then along the way Rini bilang kayak tau nggak sih, North tuh sekarang makin parah loh. Dia kayak gini pasti gara-gara ngikutin. Bapaknya gitu, tapi dia parah banget. Gimana kalau misalkan kita bikin tentang dia aja gitu? Pastiin kalau misalkan gue balik ke rutinitas gue, kalau gue kerja lagi, I will come home. I remember exactly. This is again in her porch at her house. Um, we were talking about her album and everything, and then she was like, she was asking me, um, kira-kira judul album apa yang bagus untuk album ini and she came up with like a lot of different words for it and but then I don't know I just came home because like I cared so much about this album maybe because I wrote many songs in the album um, so I came home and I slept on it and then the next day I woke up and I feel like I feel like Skins is just the perfect title for this album karena again it just shows who she really is without having to prove to the world or anyone and that is her skin Rini Wulandari and her skin um, she has layers of course she has many different personas as Rini Wulandari 
and that is shown in this album and she's really confident with it this album shows her true self it's pretty self-explanatory she is trying to just tell the world that this is me you know this is Rini Wolandari that's how I came up with the word skins to me the most special song in skins would still be come home because you wrote it for Nord and you wrote it with the intention that when Nord gets older um, he's gonna hear back and, and always carry the song until he gets older and maybe pass it down to his kids one day because you know you showed the tenderness of a hard working mother in this song and you were very pure and honest with me during the process too you are so easy 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 to write with because you know what you want and uh in this song a mother knows best and you know best on how to tell your child every time i recall that moment when he wanted this for nord because no matter how hard working you are the routines you have to do outside you promise him you'll always come back home hmm you know what one thing and i have to say this the process of making this album like me contributing with the songwriting i feel that it inspired me too as an artist and an, as a musician why i actually got so inspired in writing less metaphorically because like skins is a pop r&b type of album and in this one i was challenged to just like be direct as possible this album she just puts it out there like the emotion that she has without hiding it but at the same time it is powerful talking about her life her journey uh, her growth as an artist as a person as a human being i feel like everything is just wrapped in this album you know it has layers but that's rainy this is monumental for me as an artist it brought a part of me that i never knew was there before um so yeah uh i'm really grateful i thank rini wulandari my girl for letting me be part of this album and i mean i just love writing with rini we just exchange good vibes we have the same zodiac signs probably that's helping but <laughs> i don't know but i'm pretty sure like the feeling is mutual and i just cannot wait for this album to drop and i just cannot wait for the world for everybody to hear this album and also i wish you the best of luck in the world nini and i love you so much Mwah.